Hello, welcome to cooking with Laura. <laughs> the only thing um, I cook ever. That was a joke. Anyway, um, this video I'm going to teach you how to make a jalapeno. Um, they're really, really delicious. And here it goes. Um, you're going to need three things. The first thing is pita bread. Um, this is the kind my mom gets. I'm not sure where. Middle East style bread, but pita bread. Um, and we keep ours frozen, but I don't think that matters at all. But frozen. And then what you do, you get a plate and you put the pita on the plate. <laughs> then um, I use pepper jack cheese or mozzarella. Right now only I only have pepper jack. This one is Wisconsin's finest. Pepper Jack. Mm. Alright, so um, what you're gonna do is slice some cheese like this thin, probably. Um, let's see if you can see me doing it. Yeah. And my boobs. Awesome. Anyway, so you slice it pretty thin. Um, and you want enough to cover almost completely um, the pita, but with one thin layer of cheese, basically. So I'm going to need a little more, and that's why I have this. Sorry, I'm kind of sniffly because I was just at my friend's house who has cats, and when I'm around other cats, I get really allergic, because I'm not used to it, but I'm used to my cats. Weird, I don't know. Alright, so that looks like enough. So arrange it so there's none that are like on top of each other because then it won't melt as good. Alright, like so. And then you get some jalapenos, which is the most important part. The brand that my mom gets is called La Castaña, um, but I don't know. These are my favorite, I don't know. It's up to you. And now, if you don't like hot food, here, if you don't like hot food that much, um, like some people I make these for aren't into spicy food as much as I am, so they, I put like three jalapenos, but if you like it really spicy, um, I put like seven, um, yeah, make sure you get that juice in there too, because the juice is yummy. Alright, so that's one, I don't know. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. One more on there. Yeah, two more. Whatever. And then, um, here, let me make it so you can see what I'm doing. Okay. Um, basically the same thing, like, just spread them out. It doesn't really matter because you'll end up folding it over anyway. And then I pour, like, a little bit of sauce in there. Not too much. And then, oh, you can see I already have one pre-made. <laughs> that was from this morning. I didn't eat it, um, because I wasn't hungry, but you'll, you'll see that. Anyway, then, um, you're going to put it in the microwave for 85 seconds, and I hope all of you guys have microwaves, you should, 85 seconds, and then, because I'm such a multitasker, I like to put everything away while it's cooking, that way afterwards I can just enjoy it and not have to clean up anything. So, that's what I'm doing. Pita freezer. That way, just the bread, uh, you can keep it a lot longer. So, that's why. Um, anyway, then you just wait. But when it comes out, it's going to be really hot, so you can't really eat it right away. You have to let it cool. And then what I do, let it cool three minutes, four minutes or so. Fold it over in half. You can either, either eat it like when it's folded in half or fold it again in a quarter. My favorite is in the quarter. 
because then when you like bite into this first bite, it's so like juicy and delicious. So, um, once this, you know, once this one's ready, I'll show you how to eat it. <laughs> And I'll show you that the cheese, it's good to layer it really thin like that because then it's like burning at the edges a little, just a little, but that taste of the burnt cheese is really good. So that is uh, the jalapita. Fold that baby in half and let it cool. I'm going to save that for my friend later. But anyway, yeah, so... So freaking good. Oh, and if you're weak, um, you're gonna want to have water close by because it's really spicy. <laughs> My favorite food right here. So good. Let me know if you guys make them, how they turn out. Let me know if you have questions, anything. Um, that's about it. That's my how to make a jalapita spelled H A I mean H <laughs> sorry. G A L A P I T A. Alright. Peace.